I have been a huge fan of your work since uh, Life is a House, which was the first movie mm-hmm. I saw you in. And I think that you are amazing. Thank you oh, for thank being you. here today. Thank uh, you very much. I, I really enjoyed Slow Horses as well. Um, I love the contrast between seeing Diana and her element uh, and then seeing Slough House, uh, which is not so much in theirs. Can you talk about uh, what it's like to be a woman at the top of her game in this environment, still facing opposition? Yes, I think, um, well, Diana, I don't know what it's like, but um, I know what it's like to play somebody in that position. And I think that, um, you know, your defenses are, um, you're very alert to any kind of attack from any area. Um, I think you are keeping an eye on, you've got to have eyes everywhere. Um, She's particularly afraid of Jackson Lamb because she's known him for a very long time and he knows stuff about her and she knows stuff about him. And while that status quo is, is, you know, is held, we're we're okay. Um, But, you know, if anything wobbles there, we're going to be in trouble. And I think that what's interesting about Diana, which um, in any other production could seem sort of, um, very um, superficial is her um, is her demeanor is the way she presents herself. Uh, this armor that she has, these these impeccable clothes, the impeccable hair, the impeccable makeup, the the constant moisturizing of the mouth that is going to pronounce these terrible sentences on people. Um, you know, all those things are details that uh, are actually very were actually very helpful for me as an actress. And, um, you know, to begin with, when I read them, I thought, oh, it's just silly. But actually, no, it's very important. Um, And especially when you see in the production, you see what you mentioned earlier, the sort of the very, very, very unpleasant um, slough house, which is where the slow horses all live, which you can, just by looking at the, the images you can practically smell the disinfectant, um, you know, and the the garbage outside and the rest of it. And and where I live, which is you could, you know, there's the hum of the computers and the and the smell of um, of electronics. You know that, that that whole thing is very 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 different. Um, and I think in the production they've really captured those two atmospheres very well um and and then again you know where the the rest of the action happens is is it's it's really brilliantly done they're very good at this in this country you know in britain <laughs> we're very we're very 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 good at um creating uh, these very specific atmospheres mm. and we're very good at keeping them um keeping it sort of in a in a light-hearted way, so you get the the, the realism of it and the, the mm-hmm. sort of human aspect of it all is is really well observed, and I think that's what keeps it so fascinating. Is that uh, at one moment you're sitting on the edge of your seat, absolutely terrified of what what's going to happen next, and the next moment you're giggling about some remark that somebody's made to somebody, um, and and by giving people the the trust in the in the show that it's actually if you make people laugh, then they, they're more relaxed and then you can do what the hell you like with them, really. <laughs> Absolutely. I was uh, both laughing and biting my nails throughout the season yes. and I yeah. cannot wait. <laughs> I hope that there is two more soon. So thank you so much. Thank you very much. <laughs>